Yes, our department has received numerous complaints from parents whose children have attended your child care facility. Mm -hmm. How would you describe your safety methods? Uh, adequate, iffy. Safety first, mm -hmm. pretty much. Mm -hmm. And, uh, no, actually, safety about third. There's been 14 injuries reported just this past month, and one of the children was found playing with this. Yes. I was wondering where that went, because we were looking for this. And I thought maybe I'd left it in the, uh, with the other weapons. Another child was found having fun with this. Yeah, that was Stevie. Uh, great kid, I mean, could you make this? Is it common practice for children in your care to play with... It is. Power tools? Like yes, it's, com it's common practice. Yeah, well, that's for our advanced kids. Uh, you know. <laughs> oh, no, don't worry about a thing. I know what I'm doing. Oh, that would have been bad. Why don't you take me through a typical morning? First, the children are dropped off, and then what? Well, I wouldn't call them dropped off. I would just call them dropped. You see, we like to hold them at at least a height of seven feet. Drop them. Uh, we've also had reports that prior to nap time, children are offered a cup of Kahlua and milk. You're mispronouncing it. It's koala. I call it sleepy juice. And, uh, you know, it's real hard to get the kids to slow down without it. Is it common practice for both the children and the staff to fall asleep during nap time? Is that wrong? What you say? Mr. Hodges, the playground's on fire again. Timmy, get your bacon on and get out there and sizzle, you little freak. <laughs> He's one of the boys I dropped from eight feet.